Good day, YouTube. 20th of April, 2019, and we are Dutch Oven Cooking. Today, um, I just did a video, just posted it on a, a clean and seasoning of my, well, let's just say my daily driver uh, Dutch Oven. It gets used and abused, and I admit it, I abused the heck out of it. And it needed to be cleaned up and re-seasoned, so we took care of that. It's got video posted. If you're interested in that, check it out. We've got an 11-pound ham here. Let me find a, a knife. No, that's a knife. Um, that we need to get cooking. It is uh, Easter tomorrow, but due to uh, family work schedules, uh, we're celebrating today. So I need to get this ham in the Dutch oven and cooking uh, here very quickly. I sure wish that knife was a little sharper than that. You know what? Sometimes scissors is a better tool. Let's do that. So, uh, again, if you're interested in cleaning and seasoning, uh, that video is already posted. We don't go into it here. But... I will show you just how quick and easy doing a ham or a turkey, I do them the same, basically, uh, cooking them in a Dutch oven can be. So this is uh, about 11 pounds. Awesome. Yeah, it's going to be excellent. So uh, I cook uh, in chicken broth. I uh, basically take a container of chicken broth, pour it into the Dutch oven. This oven is hot because I just seasoned it. So we have to be real careful. We don't want to just dump it in there because a quick temperature change in cast iron could cause it to crack. And I literally just took it out of the oven. So we're going to go in real slow with the chicken broth. It's going to cool the Dutch oven slightly. She's steaming already. And I just let the oven go. The oven behind me. We're going to cook this uh, for a little over two hours at uh, about 300 degrees. Don't want to burn anything. All right. And really, that's about it. We're just doing this quick. You'll just be shocked at how good this tastes. Um, um, my... Turkey and ham are requested. Um, every holiday family meal, and I certainly don't mind. Um, We're going to set this in there without splash. Hope it fits nicely. This direction. I believe it does. It's very nice. Even spacing all the way around if you can. That lid might touch that just a little bit. It's going to shrink down when it cooks a little. Anyway. The lid isn't hot. It's just a little... It won't last too long. It's a good spitting lid. This is a 12 inch deep Dutch oven. It's a modern oven. It's not uh, antique or anything. It's just what I, the one I use a lot. I use it and abuse it. That's why we took some time. We seasoned it. Okay, I'm gonna adjust my temperature to 300. And we're gonna let that cook for a couple of hours. And I'll show you what it looks like coming out. Again, we just putting in. Let me get you out of the stand here for a sec. We just put in a what are these? 16 ounces, 32 ounces. Look at that, 32 ounce container of of chicken broth, uh, whatever brand you're you used to using. It'll be fine. Um, boy, the the ham's going to come out just as moist and. Uh, tender as you've ever ever eaten there will be 
no leftovers. And I think we only have 10 people coming, something like that. So it should be good to go. All right, gang, check back. Uh, I'll be back to you shortly when we're ready to uh, withdraw the ham out of the oven. It's time to get the ham out of the oven. I turned it off just a few minutes ago. Let the heat come out of there. It's pretty hot. Yeah. Smells good. Smells good. What do you think? Move you over here. For the unveiling. The unveiling of the ham. Looks good. This knife is dull as heck. Let me get one that'll cut. See how it shrunk down there a little bit. Like butter. Went through it like butter. Oh man, is that good. Just cuts like butter. Wow. Outstanding. Sorry, I had to eat some. I may not even get any. <laughs> but fresh out of the oven, oh man. It is really, really, really good. It's very, very easy. You just put it in and forget it. Cook it for a couple of hours. Don't cook it hot, about 300, three and a quarter, 300, depending on your oven. And it, You'll just not have a better ham. I have never had a better ham than the ham you make in a Dutch oven with the chicken broth. I'm telling you. Gang, it's almost dinner time, so I got to go. Thank you for watching, commenting, and subscribing. We made a little ham today. We reseasoned this old cast iron Dutch oven because I've been using it and abusing it. And, uh, wow, really good. Really, really good. Catch you guys on the next video.